Hi guys! Welcome to my new YouTube channel. So today, um, I'm gonna show you guys how I normally, you know, do my skincare right after I wash my face. Yeah, this is a yeah, totally no makeup face. My first product I'll be using will be the Hera Cell Essence Cell Biofluid Sink 2.0 <laughs> Yeah, I got it in Korea when I went there So typically, I'll just pour some decent amount in onto the cotton sheet that they uh, came along with When you buy the product, don't forget your neck Yep. Normally, when I have the time, I will use the leftover and I will do this. Sort of like a mini mask, but now I got no time. <laughs> anyway, the next product that I'll be using is the Han Yu's uh, Rice Essential Skin Softener. It smells awesome. Two drops, or three. You see. Pop it. After that, I'll be using the Han Yu's Rice Essential Skin Emulsion. Sadly, you can't find any of these products um, in Singapore yet. But typically, I like to pat my uh, skincare product into my skin. It feels like it's helping it to absorb. And of course, don't forget your neck. After that, I'll be using the Bioessence Face Lifting Cream Pine Pollen. I know this is the old packaging, but I really prefer the old formula much better. Using this cream, I feel like it really does give like the lifting it back. Normally, I'll just you know massage it into my skin. Yeah, this is how I do it. After that, it will be the moisturizing cream. I'm using the Ole Regenerous Microscoping Cream Moisturizer. Sounds really good. Just take a little bit. But I do really like it because it's like in the top and you know you need to dip your finger in it. Same goes to the bio essence. After that, I'll be using the L'Occitane Refined Bowl. <laughs> I don't know how to pronounce this. Yep, SPF 50. So it's just one, two, three. And then. sunscreen because sometimes it will leave like streaky white stuff so you must be you know blend it all out the last step will be caring for my lashes I'll be using the Revital Lash Advanced Eyelash Treatment I got this from Sephora online I actually went to the store and looked for them but they are not available. They are only available online. So. This is quite pricey, it's like 100 over dollars but I think it works so... The next item after that will be the Fountain Eyelash Conditioner. I feel like after applying this, 
my lashes really uh, curl small as in like the curl will last longer yeah. that's done oh the lip balm that I use is the Maybelline Doctor Rescue yeah I love this because like it's got this like very medicated taste to it yeah, after that <clears throat> it's a new product that I've been trying it's a uh, aqua power cooling CC SPF 50 from Hera it's pretty cool because like you pump this I don't know if you can see but there's things like there's stuff coming out from it it's a very cooling effect it's like a CC cream so I, I feel like applying this can you see the product? No. Oh there you go. Oh uh, apply under my eyes dark eye ring. Since there's like a cooling effect, I feel like it will help to you know give my under eyes a massage. <laughs> Then I will use in this freeze. I don't know what's this, but this is a concealer. I'm using one, and then I will use like a, a sponge from Iota's uh, cushion to blend it out. I really love this cushion. It's like so soft and nice. I don't really like to use um foundation because it's very thick. I mean, times when I feel like I need some coverage, I will use yeah, I will use this this one. It has got a lot. Uh, consistency so the coverage is much better and then if I need more coverage I will use Iope's um, cushion mine is in W21 yep. but today I feel like I don't need to get skin day after that um, because I don't like this dewy look I prefer a matte one. I will use Givenchy's powder, Universal Nude. Actually, I bought the Laura Mercier's, but I haven't uh, got to try it out yet. I heard it's very good for baking of the under eyes. So, just head in, head in. just like a daily skincare routine plus daily makeup look since I'm gonna head out after this so I thought why not show you guys too how I normally do my daily makeup look right brand new start for my new channel this is the Shui Mura's eyebrow pencil let me get a mirror Just follow like you know your natural brows shape and like me draw it on. Yeah, I like I like to go for like the Korean brows more. I don't I don't like myself with like the ucky type of eyebrows. It makes me look very fierce.
voila! After drawing your eyebrows, I will use, I will use the um, uh, Kate Brow Palette. I'll mix this two colors together. I'm gonna hit pen ring. And I'm gonna let you go over it. So, come to the nose with that. You can blend it out with the fingers after that. Ta -da! And then, normally, I'll give my eye like a pick me up because. I've been sleeping well lately to open up your eyes a little bit more and blend it out with your real finger because it's the finger with like the less pressure because your eyes is very delicate you need like little strength you can put it in the center of your eyelid and blend it out too just give like a little bit light to your eyes yep after that I will curl my lashes with a true Mara eyelash color I can show you like how lasting my curls will be after this because it really will last a whole day because I applied the serum do you see this before curling after curling And the technique of curling your eyelashes to bring it outwards. Uh huh. Check out my lash lashes. Should I apply mascara today? All right, I shall. I'm using the L'Oreal Voluminous Butterfly Waterproof Hydro Fudge. Wow, that was quite a mouthful. Yep. I really like this formula and the comb is so cool See how it separate, separates all like my lashes I hate mascara when they clump It's like the worst thing ever I'm feeling a little bit fancy today. I'll be using one two one zero two eight visual therapies eyeshadow. Mine's broken already, so <laughs> I'll use like this color. Next, Milani's Illuminating Face Powder. It's so pretty, right? It's like in a shade of rose. Number three, I'll be using Real Technique. Just take a little bit, smile, and apply your cheeks. for the natural glow. Ta -da! Last but not the least, I will end it with lip color. Alright, I'm using Etude House. I don't know what color is this. Oh my god, I really have no oh I saw it. Um it's E109. 
this is the color. It's very... So thank you guys for watching, I hope you guys like it. Do leave me some comments down below as, as to what you like to watch in the future and I'll try my best to do it. Um, I'm looking forward to my vlog in Seoul, this is the first time I'll be vlogging and I'm quite excited about it. So I hope you guys do like this video, if you do like it please share it, give me a thumbs up and subscribe!